I was actually surprised at the extent to which you have a system and a process behind the way you think about creating content and delivering it to audiences. Well, it wasn't so good, uh, let's say, a year ago. Um, a lot of content was being produced, and some of it was non-strategic. Mm -hmm. And it's expensive. C producing content is very expensive. So um, we just set ourselves uh, to saying, is it aligned with our cultural uh, description? Is it strategic to align with growth? And from market to market, that can change. Our, you know, our strategic growth plans in India are different than our growth plans, let's say, in, in Latin America or South America. So um, we align it to the business growth plans there as well. And then we run it all through this filter, this process that we have that actually starts with the CEO in a monthly meeting with him, mm -hmm. Jeff Immelt, to discuss what we're working on. Is it aligned with the, the blueprint that we've put out for growth? And um, does it make a difference? In other words, even if it's strategic and it describes our culture, we n might not be able to make a difference. So we look to measure what the impact we're having on our audiences. We streamlined our audiences from the world to four strategic audiences, basically which are our employees, our customers, thought leaders, and business decision makers, and said, those are the folks we're going after based on all of this filter that brings the content through. And it's been, it's been successful. It, it has given us a process that we can carry to our leaders and say we're disciplined, uh, we're focused on the same issues that you are, and we're producing results to help you grow.